good morning all of you uh, today we discuss on uh, recent trends in human resource management recent trends in human resource management uh, outsourcing quality circuit work life balance total quality management this is a first of all human resource management human resource management uh, means uh, developing their resources utilizing and maintaining and compensation so how to utilize of human resource how to maintain of human resource how to utilize the human resource and compensation he said today we said discuss about the uh, total quality management total quality management means uh, continual business improvement continual business process in the idea of globalization while moving towards 21st century we are bound to have breath talking accomplishment because of the change over from the wheel culture to the chip culture with the dramatic changes in the mega transformation of global economy globalization is bizarre that is the raw material for innovation is a main uh, is a tremendous big changes in all areas is the reason is the globalization is a what is meaning of globalization it's a very simple meaning is a globalization means a international business a firm that has products that are distributed sold all over the world but without the uh, local use is a global use next at the at the same time is a liberalization liberalize the liberalization means uh, liberalize the uh, industrial policy liberalize the uh, exports and the imports is a new economic policy introduced uh, in 19 next uh, privatization privatization means a uh, very simple meaning disinvestment disinvestment means a uh, private and public partnership disinvestment means private and public partnership it's a very important is a link with all some is a modern management is a number of uh, techniques adopted in organizations so what are the unique companies is a worldwide is a number of techniques is a tpm tpm uh, six sigma benchmarking quality circles is a number of techniques adopted uh, many organizations different techniques of all the different organizations this a globalization is a bizarre that is a raw material for innovation this raw material has a change is conception in industry with the corporate planning management by objectives information technology total quality management and the reengineering so on and so forth this is a corporate planning so what is the meaning of corporate plan is a corporate planning is a strict is a strictly follow the Uh, rules uh, policies uh, procedures uh, guidelines objectives is uh, a decision making it's a very important is a corporate plan very systematic the implementation is of all is a policies or uh, rules guidelines objectives is a decision making is a very important next uh, management by objectives and view so management by objective means the overall organization's objectives so overall organization objectives is a department by objectives and the uh, overall number of in a, in organization number of departments is a is a overall organization's objectives next uh, information technology 
It's a very important design information technology. Without the information technology, it's a not survival in the society. Whatever it is in technology, is a communication. It's a very important design information technology. Next, uh, total quality management. It's a total quality management means continual business improvement, continual business process. At the same time, employee involvement, employee responsibility at the same time customer satisfaction customer satisfaction it's a very important uh, it's a TPM total quality management next uh, re-engineering it's a re-engineering re-engineering uh, is a new adopted uh, machineries is a product wise it's a new machinery in a production wise on product wise. It's a very important, it's a really new machinery adopted in every organization. It's a very important, it's a, after uh, uh, globalization, uh, technology, uh, globalization uh, is a budget that is the raw material for innovation. This raw material has a change conception industry with corporate planning, management by objectives, information technology total quality management and the re-engineering, so on and so forth. In a particular sense, the importance of total quality management has also been a time to be most uh, prominent, significantly conception being practiced uh, across the globe by all organization, irrespective of nature of the. During the past uh, two decades, total quality management has also been observably the most uh, important uh, organization strategy for achieving for achieving competitive advantage by the companies. Improving the quality which can deliver its product and services is critical for expanding its global markets. It's a top level executives uh, uh, from many organizations have tremendously changes, tremendously elevated is a total quality management as an operational philosophy. It's a global corporations, it's a number of uh, global wise uh, implemented is a total quality management program. Global corporations such as Javax company, Federal Express, Exhaust Instrument, AT and T, American Telephone and Telegram have implemented aggressive total quality management program which achieve world world leadership. In India also some organization such as Latin and Turbo, BHEL, Kerloster, Crompton Grants. Madhra Boards, National Dairy Development Board and uh, Ultratech have either improved or excellent. In developed nations like the uh, UK and Japan, United States, the organizations have had success with total quality management. So actually, is a father of uh, total quality management uh, guru is a Edward Demi. He's a he's American. He's a scientist. He's a proposed uh, he's a 14 principles of uh, total quality management. Actually, it's Edward Demi is a first uh, is a top priority to quality. It's a top priority is a quality. It's a, what is the meaning of quality? Quality means uh, efficiency or excellence. Quality can have several meanings. Making it a different, understandable to different people. Quality can therefore have product based definition, customer based definition, value based definitions. It's a different kinds of mentality. 
is a different opinions on quality. Actually, it's a main uh, focus on uh, is a lower dimming in uh, quality. It's a top priority to quality. It's a, some people are uh, top priority to product based definition. Product definition, product based definitions like, uh, is a, for example, uh, Indian people says a part of product is a good product. At the same time, it's a Samsung mobile. At the same time, it's a iPhone. What is this? a company brand? It's a very important top product based definitions. Next, uh, customer based definition. It's a customer based definition means uh, user definitions. It's a user definition. Next, uh, value based definition. Value based definition. Value based means uh, cost based definition. Its importance is a uh, very important is a uh, uh, in an Indian people's is a uh, cost cost based definitions. In some people mindset uh, uh, is a cost based is a cost a high cost is a quality. Is a cheap, low cost is a uh, low quality. It's a people mindset in, in, in India. It's a very important is a Deming, uh, it's a 14 principles uh, proposed uh, uh, Edward Deming. It's a principles, 14 principles. It's a 14 principles uh, first uh, adopted uh, in Japan companies. First adopted Japan companies. It's a number of Japan companies uh, implemented total quality uh, management program. Is a modern management number of techniques adopted by different organizations. Is a TKO, is a present advanced six sigma, is a total product to management. Is including number of techniques adopted is a many organizations. Reason is a very important reason is a customer satisfaction is a very important. At the same time. Everyone responsible in the organizations. At the same time, every employee involvement is a very important. It's a first 14 principles of uh, total quality management. Uh, number one, uh, customer focus. Customer focus. It's a customer needs and the requirements to ensure that products and services constantly meet or exceed their expectations. Is it nowadays is a is a customer uh, focus is a very important. Is a customer expectations day to day changes in a technological wages. Is a opinions. Is a new product available in market. It's a very tough competition. Is a you know, in all area, uh, in all areas. Is according to any organization follow the is a first focus customer focus. Is a prioritizing customer needs and requirements. What is the customer needs and the, identify the customer needs and the requirement to ensure that products and services uh, constantly meet the, or exceed their exp expectations. Number two, continuous improvement. It's a total quality management uh, is a very important. Is a continual business improvement. This is encouraging ongoing enhancements in process is a products and the services to achieve higher levels of quality and efficiency. This is a encouraging ongoing enhancing uh, enhancements uh, in process is a products and the services to achieve higher levels of quality and efficiency. Continuous improvement. Next uh, number three employee. Involvement. It's a very important. It's a employee involvement. It's a number of uh, organization collapse in, in India. Reason behind this is a uh, central government organizations, uh, um, uh, privatizations, uh, increasing privatization. The reason is the employment. Uh, is a lack of responsibility. It's a very important. So a lot of number of companies is a privatization. It's a reason is a is a lack of responsibility. This employee involvement is a very important in an organization. Top level to lower level, lower level to top level employment involvement is a very important. Involving employees in identifying 
and solving problems uh, contributing to better decision making and sense of ownership it's a very important is a according to edward deming is a customer focus customer expectations continual business improvement and the employee involvement uh, and uh, four is a uh, process management number four is a process management uh, streamlining and optimizing process to reduce waste uh, inefficiencies uh, and the errors uh, ultimately leading to higher quality outcomes is a process management the streamlining and opportunities of optimizing process to reduce waste is a very important is a reduce is a waste uh, and the inefficiencies and the errors is a ultimately leading to higher quality is outcomes next one is a next uh, leadership commitment leadership is a very important is a leadership commitment is a very important the commitment of top management to, to total quality management principles in crucial for establishing the necessary organization culture and uh, resources is a commitment to a top management to total quality management the principles is crucial for establishing the necessary organizational culture and resources resources utilization of resources necessary organization culture and resources next uh, data driven decision making De data driven decision making use uh, using data and the measurements to make uh, informed decisions identify areas for improvement and uh, track progress towards quality goals is a data driven decision making is a very important track prog progress towards uh, quality is a goals is a next uh, supplier re uh, relationships supply relationships is a collaborating closely with the suppliers to ensure the quality of uh, incoming materials and components which can directly impact the quality of the final product is a supply relationship is a very raw material supplies is a collaborating for closely with the suppliers to ensure the quality of uh, uh, incoming materials and uh, components which can directly impact the quality of the final products next uh, training and development is a very important is a training is a now it is uh, mm, uh, is a technological changes is in all areas training is a very a very yes a very essence in human needs and abilities training and development is a see it's a training uh, is a learning process it's a very important day to day uh training uh, in a te technological changes is so you have improve your skills you have you have improve your knowledge you have you have improve abilities through training and development is a very important is in a present uh, mnc companies uh, is a must uh, implement uh, uh, day or uh, day to every day implement in a training and development is a different organization different uh, methods follow the training and development is a providing employees with the necessary skills and the knowledge to perform their roles effectively and to contribute to quality improvements is a very important is a providing employees training and development providing employees with the necessary skills and knowledge to perform their roles and the responsibilities effectively and contribute to quality improvements is a final outputs is a is a final is a quality improvement is a very important is a many advantages of uh, total quality management uh, uh, program is a number of uh, companies say you know, not only business irrespective of business number of uh, uh, organizations is a for example organizations uh, implemented a total quality management uh, program is a total pro uh, quality management program is in a pro uh, production area uh in the employee involvement employee responsibility customer expectations customer satisfactions 
uh, is a main uh, improved uh, product quality. Is a is a total quality management uh, means continual business improvement, continual business product process. And is a continual business improvement uh, means is a product quality is a very important. To total quality management ensures that uh, quality is a uh, integrated into every stage of the production process. This result in favor a defects consistent to product quality and a reduced need for costly uh, rework or uh, repairs. The TPM ensure that quality is integrated into every stage, every stage of the production process. This result in favor uh, in favor defects consistent to product quality. So ultimate as so improved uh, product quality day to day is a product technological changes improve the quality improve the quality products is a is a very important consistent product quality and uh, reduce the need for costly uh, rework or repairs next uh, enhance the customer satisfaction is a uh, is a next uh, enhanced customer satisfied by focusing on meeting customer needs and expectations total quality management helps uh, organizations uh, create products and services that better align with uh, what customers want this leads to higher level of customer satisfaction and loyalty this a customer satisfaction enhanced customer satisfaction by focusing on meeting customer needs wants preference and the expectations is a very important in any organizations. It's a very tough competition in all areas. The reason behind this is the customer expectations. Day-to-day -day changes the uh, customer expectations. According to the expectations, is a changes in a is in a product wise, is a service wise, is a very important. Uh, is an according to enhanced is a very important is a enhanced customer satisfaction. The customer total quality management helps uh, organization create uh, products and services. It's a total quality management program implemented helps to uh, implemented in organizations uh, create uh, products and services that better align with uh, what customers want. Uh, this leads to higher levels of customer satisfaction and loyalty. Uh, increased uh, efficiency. Increased efficiency. TPM encourages uh, streamlined the process and the efficient uh, workflows. This can lead to reduced uh, cycle times, uh, decreased uh, leads times, and better resources utilization, uh, resulting in cost saving and improved productivity. This increase the efficiency is the main is a resulting in cost uh, saving and the improved uh, productivity is a very important area. Next, uh, reduced waste is a Reduced waste is a very important. TPM emphasizes the identification and the elimination of waste in all forms, including materials, time, and resources. This lean approach helps uh, organizations minimize their uh, inefficiencies uh, and is a total quality management. Uh, emphasize, emphasize the identification and uh, elimination of waste is a very important waste in all forms, including materials, is a raw materials, whatever it is in a production area, is in a time, minimize time is a very important, and the utilization of the resources is a very important, is a systematic utilization of uh, the resources, and this lean approach helps organizations minimize inefficiency time. It's a very important is a total quality management, uh, is a number of organizations implemented in India, is in the worldwide. It's a UK, Japan, and the United States. The organization implemented uh, tremendously changes in all, in all areas. It's a top companies, uh, global corporations uh, implemented, and uh, MNC companies, so all are implemented total quality management. Thank you. Thank you, one